all you can eat tacos, all you can eat ceviche, and all you can eat enchiladas here at one of the hottest Mexican buffets in LA County. If you love Mexican buffets that are really good and very affordable, this is a spot I think you definitely need to check out. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Steve from Rockstar Eater coming to you with another rockin' episode. And I am out here in Los Angeles County in the city of Alhambra because I'm gonna be checking out another rockin' spot. Behind me is Chonito's Mexican Restaurant. They have a special all-you-can-eat lunch buffet. And you don't find too many Mexican buffets around LA County, so this is pretty rockin'. So I encourage you, stick all the way to the end of this video, especially if you love AYC buffets, because I'm gonna show you one of the best and most affordable ones here at Chonito's Restaurant in Alhambra. And also, if you're new to this channel, take a moment right now to hit that subscribe button, as well as the notification bell, because it posts these food and travel videos weekly you don't wanna miss out on. So go ahead, do that right now. And in the meantime, I'm gonna be heading into the restaurant, and I think I'm one of the first customers here. Oh yeah, the buffet line's gonna be very full. Let's check this out. Chonito's Mexican Restaurant has been around for 11 years and it is a local Mexican restaurant that specializes in Zacatecas style Mexican food. So it runs during the weekdays, Monday through Friday from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. And I heard that it is a pretty busy buffet. So for $18.99, you can get over a dozen choices of foods, desserts, fruits, they got it all. Starting off with some beans, as well as some rice. You definitely need that on your Mexican plate, right? And then down here, we got cheese enchiladas, very self-explanatory. And then that is chimichanga, filled with chorizo and beans from what I heard. And then down here, we have chili Colorado, and this one has beef in it from what I heard. Yeah, that looks like beef. And then up here is chicken fajitas. So yes, so if you love chicken, they got your fajitas here. And then down here, we got carne en su jugo. Wow, this is pretty cool. And then up here, we got papas a la mexicana. Those are potatoes, they look delicious. And then moving on to this section, we got chilaquiles, yes. Oh yeah, you gotta come early for this, it tastes really nice. And then over there, we got empapelado. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. This is a seafood mix with veggies inside. So I see shrimp and fish in there. Well, here we go with round number one, so it begins. So the good thing is that there is no time limit to this buffet, so if you can eat a lot and you wanna spend a lot of time eating some buffet food, this is the spot you gotta to come to. Wow, I like those beans. So they are the very runny kind of beans, which I like because it tastes great by itself and you can dip some chips into it. Makes for a really good dip. Mmm. Wow, even the rice is not bad too. Wow, very tasty rice. No, I shouldn't eat too much of it, but I think I'm gonna get more rice later on. Since it's almost breakfast time, kind of like brunch, perfect time to eat chilaquiles, right? Mmm. Wow. So much flavor. And it is a little spicy too. I feel it. It's like creeping up on my tongue. Wow. So if you like your chilaquiles, kind of a little bit on the spicy side, you're gonna love this place. Oh man. Mmm, I love the spice on those potatoes. Wow. Mm-hmm. And I think this is the first time I've seen fajitas offered in a Mexican buffet around Southern California. You know, this restaurant really does like to spice up its food. Because I've been to buffets where the food was milder in taste, but here, it's a little bit more spice driven. And this is the first time I've had chimichanga in a Mexican buffet. Mm, that's a mouthful, wow. <laughs> a little bit crispy and also very soft, kind of doughy too, with really awesome fillings. Oh man. Never had a chimichanga like this before. Chili Colorado, oh yeah. Wow, that's one of my favorites. It feels like eating a beef stew, wow. Oh, that's so comforting. Yeah, Chili Colorado is definitely one of the ones you gotta get up there. Now here's something I haven't seen in the buffet. I haven't had this in a while. Carne in Suhugo. Mm. 
Wow, it tastes just like it. You'll see bits of beef inside, beans, green onions, bacon. All of that combined makes for the carne and suhugo taste. Carne and suhugo is really one of the best Mexican foods that you can eat. A very popular homestyle Mexican food. So if you want to do it AYC, they got it here. And then this section is the build your taco section. Yeah, so those are the shells. We got pastor and we got some chicken. And up there, I guess you could make an exclusively corn taco if you want. And then down here, we got the tostada shells, which you'll use for your ceviche or any other things you want, as well as some hard shell tacos. And then some lettuce, as well as some cheese. And then we got two kinds of salsa down here from what I'm seeing. All right, let's try some of these tacos. Yeah, they got some pretty good meats up here. Let's get two of these. I think this is the first time I've assembled a taco in a buffet. This is kind of a bit of work actually, but you can really be creative as much as you want. Like you can put single protein in there or you can mix two proteins like putting pastor and chicken into one taco, which is what I'm gonna do. And don't forget your salsa too, because that is definitely gonna add a lot of flavor to your tacos. I really love the pastor, it's so uh, flavorful, it's sweet too, nice. Okay, and then the chicken, I gotta try it on this side. I feel like I can just come and just have so much fun just eating at this taco station right here. This is definitely a highlight here. And right across the street from the buffet station, there's this other section. Oh yeah, we got some menudo right here. That is beef tripe. Oh man, all right, there's a lot of this here. And underneath, you got lemon, as well as some diced onions. And check this out, we also got some fish ceviche. Oh, that's pretty fancy, all right. There's a lot of it here. And that right there is the tostada shells. So this will be very good to use with your ceviche. And this one is uh, some sort of a crab salad. So you got your ceviche and you got some nice crab salad here. Pretty cool, seafood selections. I really don't remember the last time I had menudo. Uh, this probably is one of very few times in my life that I've had a menudo. That beef tripe is a little different than I thought. So this one I think it has a little bit more of like a gelatinous texture. It's kind of chewy. But flavor wise it's good. I mean it's definitely a very well cooked beef tripe. So tacos are not the only thing you can build here. You can even build your own ceviche on top of the tostada. And once again, uh, this is fish. So if you love fish, then you're gonna love this one. That's like a refreshing taste of the sea right there. I mean, you need that because it brings balance to these other hotter, more uh, very savory foods, very sauce and soup driven. I suppose if you wanted to, you could take one of those taco hard shells and really stuff it with ceviche so that you can have a ceviche hard taco. Wouldn't that be something? So this is pretty much the last section. You got your jello of different colors, arroz con leche. That's the kind of like the white colored one. It's a little hard to see, but uh, yeah, this is the build your own salad. You get tomatoes, some red onions, garbanzo beans, and then uh, let's see, olives beets and you got uh, some more i think that's kidney beans and that's the lettuce cucumber as well as uh, melon cantaloupe and then you got your two salad dressings the one to the left is ranch and the one to the right is pepita cilantro dressing pretty cool huh and i heard that the buffet selections kind of change a little bit depending on what day you come but i think for the most part these are the selections. Definitely digging the tacos, all you can eat taco pastor. I could just sit here and just eat a lot of that. But even the chili Colorado, carne and suhugo, the uh, ceviche, all really awesome stuff. So yes, if you're looking for one of the most affordable buffets that you can find in LA County, here in Alhambra at Chonito's Mexican restaurant during the weekdays from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Before I close out this episode, I want to give a shout out to Gilbert and the staff here. So when you come to this restaurant, 
Mention to him that you saw this video and he's gonna hook you up with a free agua fresca with dining, is that right? That's right, Steve, agua fresca de sandia. All right, that's an awesome deal. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. You know what to do? Like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next food adventure.